my new shovels here. I modified with some duct tape. Got these at Harbor Freight for about $7.99 a piece. I've got a, uh, the one inch Harbor Freight pump. Just the uh, mini high banker I built. And uh, got Vortex mat running down the uh, sluice box here with expanded metal. And it's a Keen Super Mini sluice with a extension on it. Just used some galvanized sheet metal and made that. I bought a rivet gun and attached it there to the end. And there's the uh, Keen Super Mini sluice there. Then I uh, again made uh, another uh, crash box here with some galvanized sheet metal. Got some conduit legs and uh, some aluminum bought from Home Depot, just tubing here. And then another uh, this galvanized sheet metal here, made the hopper out of. And I've got some holes I drilled. And I'll load this up with about three or so shovelfuls and just let it sit here and just let it wash off for a while. And then I'll just work it down some and just make sure that grizzly stays open so any kind of heavies can work its way down. And the thing is, when you run it flat like this, you have to occasionally actually work the, uh, work the rocks off the grizzly. But for the most part, most of the gold is in the uh, vortex mat here I have. So I feel pretty safe actually putting a lot of shovel loads in here. There's no worry of losing any gold. bank I'm working, putting this hard pack through the high banker. Let's give you guys an idea what it looks like. And there's the uh, vortex mat with the expanded metal.
and there's the vortex mat in the hopper. You can't really see it. Okay, it ran for about an hour. Uh, I see a couple, couple specks of gold. Nothing big standing out. Okay, so I'll do a clean out of this uh, vortex mat real quick. Okay, so here's the uh, vortex mat that was in the hopper. I'll do a quick clean out. You can tell I'm working a lot of clay. Still a good bit of clay caked into the grooves here. Okay, so let me pan this down. Pretty good, so far so good. the hot banker for about an hour and a half and I can see some gold in the mat I don't know if you guys can see that it's pretty dark there's a piece right there there's a little bit right through here and here's the bank so I ran for about an hour done a clean out of the top mat ran for about an hour and a half and I'm about to do a clean out and there's the bank so far Okay, this is my uh, second clean out of that vortex mat. Oh, that's a nice one right there. <laughs> 